Well, we're finally here. We're about to open up to the rest of Australia, indeed, the rest of the world. And if you're like me, one of those people that have been suffering from av gas deprivation, or maybe you're a West Aussie who's dying to see family and friends interstate and overseas, you're probably wondering what travel post-pandemic looks like. There's only one place to find out. It's right here at Perth Airport. Whilst some airports may have gathered dust over the past two years, Perth Airport took the opportunity to continue its upgrade program and its leadership when it comes to passenger safety and wellbeing. Perth Airport was recognised as the first Australian airport to be awarded an International Airport Health Accreditation, which acknowledges that the COVID safe processes and measures that were implemented are world class, an accreditation which has now been renewed for a second year. Remember, all the standard safety procedures apply here. Sanitise on a regular basis. There's stations throughout the airport. Give your fellow guests a couple of square metres of space and make sure that when you're checking in, you check into the airport with your QR code, but also your QR codes into each of the venues that you're visiting. You do have to wear a face mask in the airport and also on your flight, except for when you're eating. One example of how Perth Airport is taking it to a whole new level is the introduction of a new wave technology that allows motorists to enter the airport car parks without having to touch entry, exit and pay machines. Less contact, less risk, right? Another great example of this is the rollout of an online food ordering and payment system, allowing passengers to pre-order and pay for items on their device and then pick it up at the terminal making for a convenient and seamless internal experience for travellers. One of the initiatives that Perth Airport has achieved here that I'm particularly proud of as a West Australian is this one. At the gate, when you go through to any of the destinations, you will see not only the commonly known name, but in respect for the rich Aboriginal culture and history, the traditional custodians have shared the name of the place that you're flying to, and it's shown there on the gate. It's a chance for us to learn more about this rich Aboriginal history that we have here in WA. There are over 100 nations, and in some cases, we're losing language. This, in many ways, is a gift to our children's future. It is an absolutely wonderful initiative. The airport's food and beverage and shopping experiences are returning better than ever, with some new highlights along with your old favourites. And how's this? Launch of the first pay-per-use Aspire Lounge, so passengers can escape the hustle and bustle and relax and recharge. Travellers can enjoy freshly prepared hot and cold food, barista-made coffee, fully serviced spa, all included in the entry fee. Now, the thing that's paramount to remember here is that when you're travelling through Perth Airport, you're doing so safely. You've got all the mod cons and conveniences you could ever want. So it doesn't matter if you're going to Broome, Exmouth, the East Coast or international, you're doing it well. And remember, it's not all about getting out. In fact, it's more about coming in. So if you've got friends, families, loved ones, Bring them into WA, encourage them to come here, knowing they're travelling through this amazing hub and entering this incredible state we live in.